Well, hello there, fellow crafters. This is Touche. It's been a while, but I am back with an unveiling of mail. Now, last week, Anna Griffin was on for her October 3rd uh, presentation, and she came out with the Cricut Maker. A lot of folks had already ordered the Cricut Maker in advance, and uh, so she came on with <clears throat> her presentation to show the Cricut Maker and to show a bundle that came with it. Well, I did not take advantage of that. Um, I'm going to need a little bit more time in order to decide whether or not I really want to get another machine. So in the meantime, what I did order and what I received just recently in my shipment was the Anna Griffin uh, bowl maker. And so I'm going to show you a little bit on top of all the different size bows that you can make. And I don't know if you can, there you go. You can see where you can pull your ribbon through those uh, openings and always have it ready for you to uh, start with your bows that you want to make and put on your cards, <clears throat> on your page layouts. And it also came with the Christmas collection ribbon. Gave you uh, the three inch red and green. And then I think that is a half an inch, if I'm not mistaken, of the smaller threads, which is the uh, Christmas red, the gold, and the silver. Okay, just wanted to share that with you. Now I'm going to take a minute to remove uh, these items from my table so that I can show you the other items that I received in my shipment. So bear with me as I move the camera just a second out of the way. And let's see here. I can pick this up and move it. There we go without hitting the camera. Oh boy, that was a trick for me to do. So I got that done. Now what I'd like to do is take time and share with you the other items that I received, but I'm gonna move this to another location so that I don't damage it before I actually put it together. Okay, so we've got that out of the way. <clears throat> I don't know what's wrong with my voice. It's a little weird today, but anyway. The other items that I ordered were the um, Christmas shaker cards, and it's coming up right now. Looky, looky, looky. Isn't that exciting? Christmas shaker card kit. Now, the reason why I jumped on this is because you get auto shipping, and when you get the auto shipping, you get more updated uh, type of uh, holiday uh, shaker cards for you to put together, you know, like Valentine's Day and then the spring holidays and all of those. But anyway, I just wanted to take a few minutes and share with you all of the good stuff that you get in this container. You get your envelopes, you get your card backing, and inside has sentiments, and then you get your overlays and your embellishments they're beautiful i can't wait to get started now i've had these for a couple of days but i've been <clears throat> a little under the weather started feeling a lot better today so that's why i'm going to go ahead and and uh, get things going here over here on this side you have all of your sequence that you put into your shaker cards isn't that wonderful so that was a nice kit that i ordered now when i ordered this kit i thought oh my goodness i said you know what? I said, I wonder if she's ever going to come out with the die cuts so that we can make our own. Well, she did. And here we go. So I ordered them. The Christmas, this is the Christmas confetti die. And you get three of those. And then this is the shaker window cutting dies, which I was just talking about when I said, I wonder if she's going to come out with the dies for them. So let me show you the shaker window dies. These are really nice. And I can pull this open. You know, this was a hard container to open up. That's why I opened it up ahead of time. 
Here she has her instruction sheet. And look at these, aren't these beautiful? So see, you can make your own uh, die cut, uh, not die cut, but your own shaker card uh, window frames and then put your acetate, acetate paper behind it and inside the acetate, <clears throat> make it like a little pocket and then put your own different color sequence in there and then you can do the stars and you can do the hearts isn't that exciting and embellishments i can do the embellishment just like the other embellishments i just showed you you can make your own embellishment and stamp your sentiments on that how nice is that and like i said she gives you uh, a little instruction sheet examples on how you can do it this one is cute with the stars. That one's a happy birthday. You know, you got to have those birthday cards every single year because every year somebody's getting a year older. Yeah, true. So it's okay to have in advance a lot of birthday cards already set up. And what I'd like to do is make uh, a set of birthday cards and give them as Christmas gifts uh, to people who can go ahead and address them and send them out. So those are going to make great gifts to send out for uh, future birthdays. And one other thing I want to share with you was the other one. And this is the one that had the Christmas confetti die. Now this is what I liked about it is the fact that when you get ready to make your inside, instead of using sequence, look at that. You've got Christmas bells and you've got the holly. You've got the snowflakes, small ones and the larger ones. And then you got the Christmas trees, small Christmas tree and the mini Christmas trees. You can cut those out of your sequence, um, not sequence, but your, um, you can cut them out of your, um, your paper that is the Christmas colors, like the foils. You can do it in the foils. You can do it in the metallics and you can do it, I was saying sequence, but maybe I was right, in the sequence uh, type of Christmas uh, paper, just just take a day and just cut out a whole batch of them and then put them aside and then when you're ready to make your cards put them inside and you've got your christmas confetti cards that's going to be fun i'm planning on using this this weekend when i go and do some cropping with a friend okay that is pretty much all that i wanted to share with you today let me see if there's anything else in here in this packet oh just some examples on how they look when you cut them out pretty cool huh so you can use it on your um you can use it on your big shot you can use it on your cuddle bug you could use it on your gemini yeah that's gonna be fun okay folks i just wanted to take a few minutes and uh, get caught up to date with you on some of the things that i've been up to and so in the meantime i just wanted to share with you the unveiling of a shipment that i just received and uh, I wanted to take time and bring you up to date with some things that I had uh, ordered. So this is Touche. And again, I want you to make it a creative day. Have a good one.